thank you. I'm a little bit nervous to be the first out. Uh, and I've lost my uh, papers uh, also. Uh, but I'm very thrilled to be here with 700 landscape uh, persons uh, in this uh, fantastic uh, Art Deco Hall. Uh, I wake up f five o'clock in the morning with the snow outside and came here down in the commercial road. So it's a big, uh, uh, big uh, difference. Uh, I have six photos to, uh, to show you. Um, I am president of the Landscape Architect Association of Norway, and uh, we are also 19 years old this, uh, uh, this year, but six months younger than you. Uh, you started in May, we in November. Um, and yes, we are neighbors. It's only the North, North Sea uh, uh, in between us. Uh, I was also very happy to uh, uh, be uh, a part of your celebration this year uh, uh, in uh, uh, the Olymp Olympic Park uh, in June. And I was uh, very well welcomed. So th it became kind of this uh, heartful uh, or maybe uh, almost low between Landscape Institute and the Norwegian Landscape uh, Association. Here with uh, uh, Dan and um, Yvonne with the English wind in my hair. Um, all this was for the big event. It was six years of uh, planning and two years of hard working with this uh, international uh, landscape architect. Oh, I have to be here. Uh, <laughs> uh, festival, I will say, in Oslo in September. We thought only, well, I th thought maybe 350 would come, but, and maybe 700, but uh, it turned up 1,500, and that is big for Oslo, since we are only 10% of the, the size uh, than London. Um, and I had a strong feeling that I was not uh, president of a landscape architect association, but I was lifted up by, by, I was part of a landscape movement. And I think we are in this landscape movement now that is so large. The landscape architect have the blue green tools that the world are demanding. Uh, I found this on the net because it's very cute. Uh, I say we are a family. <laughs> we are maybe your third cousins, but look at this uh, picture. You know, you, uh, I think you know, uh, know uh, two of them, at least, some years ago. But I, I thought that's fantastic with this uh, British queen that have reigned more than six years and have endured three Norwegian kings, in fact. Uh, you, I, don't know, I don't think you know the, uh, their um, uh, faces, but now is the youngest of the three men that are the Norwegian king. So she has survived, uh, she will maybe survive three Norwegian kings. <laughs> I think, so, yeah, and we are in the blood family. So it, I think that was a good, uh, uh, because I think sometimes the British, they forget their cousins in the north. Um, and that leads us, maybe we could do something uh, fun together in the 20s in the 2020s, since we are neighbors. Uh, um, in this uh, Brexit politic times, uh, we can do a lot of things together. And here, Britain is a superpower when it comes to the North Sea coast. Since there are seven countries, France, Belgium, uh, Germany, Denmark, and, and Norway, uh, so this, in this small sea could be a very interesting for, the, uh, for, for our uh, common landscapes for the future. Uh, maybe before 2029, when we will be 100 years, uh, celebrate 100 years. Um, thank you very much. I have a little present to, to uh, Adam, the president, a little book.
Yes, it's, it's uh, Norwegian landscape architecture has also produced nice projects the last 20 years. So uh, here's a resume uh, in Norwegian, but in English too. Oh, that's handy. Thank, thank you very much. Thank you very much.